last Thursday we had Earth Day and yes this video probably made more sense last week but hey I'm still learning okay Earth Day how did it start it with an oil spill near the coast of Santa Barbara in California in 1969 the amount of the oil spilled into the water was so enormous that it killed around 10,000 uh, seabirds animals living near the coast and as a reaction to those events Earth Day was created activists working for Earth Day talk a lot about climate literacy 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 no tu jestem tu jestem hello these people make choices in their lives trying to to have the least impact on the climate and environment. So for this Earth Day I want to change one of my not so sustainable habits. A few years back I found a crowdfunding for reusable swaps called Last Swap. It was interesting but in the beginning I was like ew. So after processing it I realized that we wash and reuse many things in our life. Why not do it with things like swabs or cotton pads? I went online to one of my favorite Polish eco-ethical shops and purchased some last object objects so here it is my first unboxing this was set really weird oh oh so there is no plastic foil nothing like that i bought something called last round because as it says on the package every time you use one round you use 10 liters of water this is so nice the case is made from a reused ocean waste plastic one pack of it contains seven rounds and they are good for 1000 uses so you take it from here and then it lands on the other side you store it here uh, you take a round from the top add water use it wash it squeeze out the water let it dry then store it in the bottom this package of seven rounds can save up to 10,000 liters of water. Second thing. Okay, so second thing is the product that I found in the very beginning. Uh, so the reusable swab. You just save the planet from up to thousand cotton swabs the package is plant-based and it allows you to bring this wherever you go it's 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 interesting <laughs> it really is so you wash it with uh, with warm water and soap so it is made from durable non-toxic materials it's flexible but still durable in a way that it doesn't bend when you don't want it to bend see yep the last thing I ordered from last object is last tissue I I, I use tissues a lot mostly because I'm allergic to cats and I do have 
a cat. Every time you blow your nose with a regular tissue, you use approximately two liters of water. You are awesome! You just saved the planet from more than 3,000 single-use tissues and their plastic packaging. Okay, so you take out one from the bottom. You... It's like a... like... Like the ones that I used to remember from, from when I was younger. You use it and then you just sort of fold it however you want it and you stash it up on the top so it pushes the other tissues that are still inside down to the bottom where you can take another one. There is a silicon part that separates dirty tissues from the clean ones. Apparently I'm talking way too long and my camera is even turning off. What is really cool about Last Tissue, I found it on their website. I'm not sure if it works the same way with Last Swab or the Cotton Rounds. Last tissue each color is connected to helping other endangered species and the black ones are for bats yeah and obviously as i was online this is so nice okay so i wanted to buy it for such a long time it's it's like a bowl uh made out of coconut all right, enough.